Good evening, everybody. I'm working on this round here. It's a one of these scenic things. Uh, we MOT failure, but I just thought because these uh, these coil packs are proven handy to access in this thing. So a few back probes in these coil packs, and these are the probes that come with this this mixig. So. A bit of reflection there, uh, with this here, but that's the, uh, the lights here in the garage. Not much you can do about it unless you turn the lights out. But uh, yeah, these are uh, the 10 to 1 probes that come with the uh, thing. You get four of them. There's a four channel scope. Uh, Three hundred volts I can take, but these are ten to one, so I'm happy enough doing uh, a wee primary on it here. Uh, so there's all four, blattering away. Now this other thing here, we can go up and down. Turn these channels off, hit that twice, turns it off, hit that twice, turns it off, hit that twice, turns it off. So pull it down. This thing here is your trigger. You set the trigger there, just a of the baseline. So there's a wee primary waveform there. Now screw that a little bit. Turn that back on again. Turn that back on again. Turn that back on again. Uh, set. You can hit this hit this top S twice. That changes the time base. And go down again for that. You can also press that button there. And you can screw it around as well. Hit any button hit the screen there. No re feature with this. So scroll across. that up there. Uh, you get a total capture, there's an RV menu here, hit the zoom button. That's the whole thing it's capturing there. Just bring out to ABS down. Back to four again. There's the whole cap. That's the whole uh, duration there. So we just turn that off. Bring it down to four again. Oh. So just messing about with this here. Boots up dead quick. And it's all touch screen. So another wee one here I'll maybe show you is this video. So, it's now recording all that. So apparently this will record 3.8 hours, uh, purely because of the size of the memory it's on. Can't remember the size of it, but somebody's worked it out at 3.8 3 hours. Hope you can hear me okay over this engine noise. So there's, uh, there's 30 seconds there. We'll just stop that. Um, so hit this back button, it's into this menu here, video play, there's my wee video, and that's uh, let's play it, so you could pause that somewhere where it's interesting, oh, just hit that once.
take it back. So out of that, back into the screen again. Oscilloscope. Stop it. Bring that up. Hard to do one hand, as everybody says. So you can stop your capture. And zoom it in. So there you go. You bring it down again. There you go. Prime ignition on a Mexic. Just thought I'd show you that. That's about. Uh, I've only had this a couple of days, so just messing about with it. And uh, it just works like a smartphone. So it does. So uh, there you go. Whenever it's uh, uh, capturing there in real time, it's a bit all over the shop. So you just stop it. And then, you can zoom in. Wasn't much good. Bring out that Amiga. So there we go, Premier Ignition and a Mexig with the probes. I need to maybe need to dial these probes in. Uh, I've just pulled them out of the bag and connected her up. So it's 10 to 1, these probes. Uh, if you're doing this with an ordinary lead, you maybe want to use a, a 20, 20 to 1 attenuator and then stick that. I've actually owned 20 there. So anyway, just thought I would do a sweet demo because uh, I've got a car here with uh, easy to access uh, coil packs. Okay, all the best. Ciao, bye-bye.